back to my channel, Subscription Boxes and More with Michelle. And if this is your first visit, thank you for stopping by. And I hope it won't be the last time you come and spend some time with me. What do I have to share with you today? It is Timu. And as you can tell by this bag, this was sent to me for review by the folks at Timu. Thank you very much. And let's just dive in and see what I got. This, I believe, is like a sunshade thing for my car. Yes, this um, is a sunshade for my car. Well, yes, it is magnets so that it will um, go up on the um, wind, you know, around the window. I think this is for the driver's side so that you can still see. See, I can see you. You can see me. Uh, so that while you're driving, you can have it up and it's not the sun's not blinding you but you can still see out so you can drive safely that's what that is i wish i would have bought two so i could have one for the other side but was i thinking well no i wasn't <laughs> oh, i'll order another one next is another sunshade for my car let's see how that one works I guess I must have gotten two because I'm like, what if this one doesn't work? What if I don't like it? You know, whatever. What if it doesn't fit? Or maybe this one goes over the windshield. I don't remember. That's what happens when you can't make the video right away. And I try to make the video within a day or two of the stuff coming, but I had a lot going on. All right, so there are suction cups. Another suction cup. So there's three suction cups. And. Then this shade would help if I could hold this. The shade pulls down. Maybe that was for the window. Well, anyways, guys, the suction cups up, and then this pulls down. Um, question: How does it stay down? Maybe that's why you need the third suction cup. Maybe one goes here, one goes here, and one goes here for when you pull it down it maybe it suction cups into place i don't know because there's no instructions i'll have to look it up there are different aha so this yeah when it when you pull it down suction cups to here i answered my own question because this has a groove here and this fits in it but then this has a place that these go through and so that's going to be pretty awesome i have very photophobic eyes very very light sensitive and when i go outside it's very hard to drive when you can't see through the little slits and you, know, you squint your eyes up sorry needed a drink if you've been watching my channel for of course it's all bent thank you mail carrier or mail folks in general all right or customs people or whoever this is for my car if you've been watching my channel very long then you know my number two item followed just behind hitting the lottery so i can afford to do this is I want to go to the UK, specifically London, but all of the UK. That is the number two thing on my bucket list. So I got this to go on my car, keep calm and carry on, but it's a bit bent. I'll have to work with it and it'll be fine. Love it, love it. I got some other um, Union Jack things in another um, haul that I can't wait to show you. And the next item is for cleaning my coffee cup and stuff. Because the one I have, the rainbowy one that I have, is wearing out. So this is for cleaning my cup. It's a spongy thing that you clean cups and it's very it can go real small so you can clean down in your water bottles and all that stuff with that that'll see a lot of use 
move some plastic out of my way and get the next item out. The next item is also from my car in this little package. I wish they would have been a little more picky on their placement of collars. This was supposed to be rainbowy uh, rhinestones and they're mostly clear and just a few randomly placed collared ones. I, I wish that they were more evenly dispersed. Um, it's got a sticky thing. It goes around my start button on my, my ignition button on my car. It's just going to be all blingy blingy because I have one of those push button ignitions. So that's pretty cool. And then I have this uh, was a disappointment. I've seen these things, guys, because again, my package was left on my porch in a serious downpour. And the bag was so soaked, I figured everything was ruined. Um, this was supposed to be a unicorn that, like, little dashboard setting unicorn and instead it's some kind of weird I don't know um, it looks to me more like a coaster and it doesn't say I mean I'm disappointed that it's not what I thought I was getting but not disappointed because I can use it for a coaster I think so regardless uh, it says be mine didn't know that it said that but what I thought it was was a little unicorn that you know figure that sat on a little thing like this and it was like in the center of it not what I was no <laughs> not not even close but um it's very silicone so it definitely will work as a coaster so that's what it's going to be for me, not what I wanted, but what I got. Um, and that doesn't happen very often. I usually am not disappointed. Usually things are exactly what I expected. This is a tool to clean the hair out of your brushes and combs. I don't know why you'd use it for your comb, but it is to clean the hair out of your brushes. It's got these wire hooks and it grabs the hair, you know, you, the bristles on your brush which I don't have one in here go figure um it you so it's, this is your brush you know the part that you the bristles that you brush your hair with and you rake this through and it pulls all the hairs out of your brush and cleans your brush that's what that's for or I guess you could rake very tiny leaves <laughs> I'm a goof all right, that is that, and I will definitely get a lot of use out of that. I'll probably buy one for my mom as well. And there's more stuff in here. Guys, I have ordered this now. This is my second time getting it. It's not like, um, what do they call it? Alien tape or something? I, it's not the Alien brand tape, but it's double-sided tape. And I liked it so well, I got a bigger roll. So it's not only is it bigger this way, so more tape, but it's also a little bit wider. I'd say like a quarter of an inch wider than what I had before. And this stuff works pretty well to stick stuff up specifically on my walls where I don't want uh, to put any more nail holes. But, you know, use it, it works for all kinds of stuff. Like my mom's little mini fridge that holds, it's supposed to hold um, like a six pack of sodas or whatever it says Diet Coke on it but she gave up Diet Coke so it's got bottles of water well the fridge moves around because it's so small and when you go to open the door it sort of slides we put this stuff under the feet of it and now it doesn't go anywhere so there's all kinds of uses and that's just one um, it's got like a plastic that you pull off and um, so it keeps it from getting stuck to everything it's still sticky on the sides but I love this stuff I'm going to order some more of it um might start ordering it which is about every order I make because I like it that well another item for the car this is for my car I am so short I'm only four foot ten my seat belt goes across my neck 
And if I would get in a wreck, it probably would break my neck. Um, these are seat belt, um, like, what do you call them? Safety, I don't know, buckle things for your seat belt so that you can adjust it so that it goes across your shoulder and not across your throat like mine does. I tend to wear my seatbelt improperly. I put it under my arm and then, you know, it's not going to be as effective in an accident. Um, so I have these, or it came with two of them, so that I can fix that problem so I can wear my seatbelt properly and not get injured as badly in an accident. What do I have in here? Oh, two more items in this bag. Okay. Um, the other day, speaking of cars, my um, windshield was hit by a rock that was thrown up by a uh, semi truck that did not have any mud flaps, which is not supposed to be legal. Well, I got their information. I called their insurance company. Their insurance company says it's a hazard of the road. Too bad. We're not going to fix your windshield. Well, yes, throw, throwing rocks is a hazard of the road, but that is why they're supposed to have the mud flaps. One of the reasons, right? Anyways, this is windshield crack repair kit. And I'm hoping that that hole in my windshield, not a hole, it's a, a chunk out of it, but it doesn't go all the way through. But thankfully, knock on wood, really hard. There's no wood around me. Yes, there is, right here. Um, knock on wood. There's no spider webbing out from it. So I'm hoping that this is going to keep that from happening. Um, I don't really want to take it out of the packaging, but just know that that's what this is. It is a windshield crack repair kit, and I'm going to try that as soon as it's not raining. It's got angry clouds out there. Even though it's not raining, I'm afraid it will rain before it's dry, so I will have to wait. This I got for my son, my oldest, Mark. He has a big, like, ZZ Top looking beard, okay? This is a keychain, and it says, You're my favorite weirdo with a beard. And he's pretty weird, so I thought he would like this. And I'm going to send it to him in Ohio, just because. Just your mom is thinking of you. Let me see if I can get that to quit swinging. Hopefully you can see it. Of course, I'm shaking. Anyway, I hope you saw it. Um, very cute. I'm going to put it back in the little Ziploc so that nothing happens to it. And I will send that to him. Hopefully, I can send it out tomorrow. Alright, that's all in that bag. But then I have things in another bag. Next thing is a car trash can. The box got a little whooshed car trash can all right so here's a piece that goes to it I think that this helps to hang it up well yes because there's like that okay let's look and see how this it has a band that <gasps> guys wow I'm glad I got some small trash bags then you could, um, no, I thought it could fasten the lid shut, but it doesn't. But it does go across here and holds it so when you're not using it. And then here is this little hanger thing that you can hang it. No, it doesn't go like that. It goes in these and it can hang from something in your car. Or there is a Velcro Really? Let go. There is a Velcro on the bottom that has a sticky thing that you can stick it to something, maybe your center console or something. But then um, you push on the lid and it pops open. See? That is really super cool. Features made of polyester cloth, it is strong and durable to provide maximum strength and durability with long service life. 
ergonomically foldable design for space saving and easy carrying can be hung in car headrest and air vent with adjustable hook so this is meant to to hang like from your headrest behind like behind the passenger or driver seat or from the air vent with this and see it's got different heights of these little the little part that comes up you know the little hanger here you can hang from different levels depending on where you want to hang it from easy to fix in position with bottom adhesive tape and that's what I said it's got velcro and it's got an adhesive spot mode of operation method one raise headrest of car seat and fix the hook to the pole or bend strap into a hook shape and insert strap through the car vent uh, air vent connect plastic uh, trash can to the hook with desired in uh, the desired position remove unnecessary parts from the hook so it bends and breaks so you don't have to have this extra bit hanging if you you know wherever you want it you can break it off method two separate the magic stickers at the bottom of the trash can rip off the adhesive paper on the magic sticker and stick it in the ideal position stick the trash cans to the glue magic sticker so wherever you want to put it like i said like maybe your armrest or something warning do not attach the pop-up trash can to driving controls all right signal switches or steering wheel okay don't think you should have to tell people that um do not hold liquids so it's not meant for you to dump your soda in do not load more than three kilograms of cargo so don't overload it and wow guys i yes yes all day yes i'm gonna buy one of these for everybody i'm gonna buy one for my my son i'm gonna buy one for my son-in-law i'm gonna buy one for my sister i might buy one for my brother maybe i'll buy a couple of them for my brother for on his boat what do you think maybe one for his car and a couple for his boat and i got little four gallon i don't think they make trash cans uh liners smaller than four gallon but you know, I got new trash bags and I can put it in there and keep from ruining my little trash can. I love it. Tell me what you think. Do you love it? I love it. I can't wait to put it in my car. I'm, I hope to show you a video of the things for my car and a video of things for my kitchen. Uh, besides this, this is just the unboxing. I hope to do those videos separately so we can see it all together. All right, what else is down in here? Do you know what it is? It is new, extra thick, extra long lasting air fresheners. Fashion fresh, and they're like a leaf instead of the palm tree, or palm tree, instead of the pine tree. I wish it was a palm tree. Um, there are six in here, I think. So six different scents. I'm gonna keep them in here so that the smell will stay strong, but we're gonna take it out and sniff it and see if we can smell them. The top one is apple. I can smell it. Doesn't really smell like apple because it's in with all these other scents. The next one is pink and it's jasmine. That might be the smell I'm smelling. The next one is purple and it's lavender. They all smell the same right now. Next one is yellow and it's vanilla. No, nope, they all smell new car. That's the smell I'm smelling. New car. And the last one is strawberry. And it's red. Blue for new car. Um, which one do I want to try first? Right now, I have the pink steering wheel cover. So I think I'll go with Jasmine just because it's pink. And I'm going to open that one up and see what it smells like outside of the packaging. And the rest of them are going to go in here for later. I'm going to keep them in their little package so that the smell stays nice and strong. 
but let's take a sniff. That I'll do on camera just to let you know what they smell like. But then I want to do, like I said, a video of all the things from my car and a video for all the things in my kitchen and one for the nail thing. That smells strong and it smells good actually. I like that. I like those. Uh, if you've seen them, buy them. If you like, you know, if you want things to air fresheners for your car, I think you'll like them. Um, that one smells real good. I'm going to put it back in the plastic before I take it outside here in a minute if it's not raining. <laughs> um, now my hand's smelling like jasmine. That's nice. I like those. And they're a nice size. So let me know what you guys think. What did you like? What did you not like? What have you gotten yourself that I've gotten? Tell me what you think. And please give me that big old thumbs up because you know that would truly help my channel. And please subscribe to my channel. And please share my video with others so that maybe they might subscribe as well. You never know. They may not have heard of Timu yet. Thank you so much for watching and for listening to me babble. I'll see you again soon in another video. Probably Timu. Bye guys.